Hello my darlings and welcome. In this video I'm going to create a page in my book of shadows, a recipe for black cat oil. This spell oil is used to change your luck, bring luck in gambling, and break curses and hexes. Let's do some magical crafting. If you'd like to download a PDF of this grimoire page, please visit Magical Crafting on Patreon at the link below this video. My patrons can download recipes, Book of Shadows pages, artwork, and more, all provided as PDFs. And I continue to add new downloadable content as I do more projects on the channel. If you'd like to see how I set up my watercolor palette, I have a separate video on that process and I'll leave a link to it below. When I design a page in my book of shadows, I start with a pencil sketch. Then I go over it with waterproof ink and erase my pencil lines. And finally, I go back in with watercolor paint to add colors and backgrounds. I've also created a video of me making black cat spell oil using the recipe on this grimoire page. I'll put a link to that video below. The herbal correspondences I've chosen are all based on my personal oil recipe. You do not need to use as many herbs as I do and you can personalize your oil ingredients to focus on what's important to you. Black cat oil is a traditional New Orleans preparation. It's a lucky oil, particularly for witches, tricksters, charmers, and loners, and for people who have a feline nature. European tradition says that a black cat is unlucky, but in the Afro-American folk magic, black cats are considered good luck and as helpers to magic folk. This oil can also be used to keep bad luck away, break hexes and curses, it has herbs of purification included for these reasons. Black cat oil is a component of gambler's lucky charms. It also lends power to spells for second sight, stealth, and luck. Use black cat oil as an anointing oil to boost witchy powers and slip away from bad luck. Invisibility, enthrallment, clairvoyance, charisma, all of these fall into the domain of black cat magic. You may wish to work black cat oil spells during the waning or dark moon. One of the traditions surrounding black cat oil is that the master bottle it's blended in must contain a bone from a black cat. This is absolutely not true and should not be attempted. The first ingredient is myrrh. Myrrh is not an herb but a resin and appears in a number of religious and spiritual contexts. Myrrh, like frankincense and sandalwood, is associated with purification and cleansing. Myrrh amplifies your magical intent. You can also blend myrrh into an incense to use for purifying sacred spaces or to consecrate magical tools and other items. In some magical traditions, myrrh is incorporated into workings to break hexes and curses, or for protection against magical and psychic attacks. The next ingredient is sage. Sage is a powerful magical herb which has been used for hundreds of years as a cleansing and purifying herb. Its magical energies make it a great choice for protection spells, and it's also powerful when used in money and abundance spells. Sage is used to ward off evil and cleanse a space, a person, or items. It corresponds to wisdom, good luck, long life, and some even say immortality. It's an herb of good health, protection, purification, healing, and clarity. Ancient Romans, Greeks, and Egyptians used sage medicinally to treat snake bite and enhance memory. It's thought to be an herb of wisdom and clarity and to help with grief from the loss of a loved one. Bay leaf is an herb that is oftentimes found in kitchen spice cabinets. Bay leaves are protective of the home and person. 
they clear a space of harmful energy. Among other uses, bay is a protection and purification herb and is worn as an amulet to ward off negativity and evil. It's burned or scattered during exorcism rituals. Bay leaves mixed with sandalwood can be burned to remove curses and evil spells. Bay leaves are often associated with wish magic and money drawing magic, making them a perfect addition to an oil for bringing good luck when gambling. Grains of Paradise is indigenous to the west coast of Africa. It's a relative of both ginger and cardamom. This is what gives it its peppery floral flavor. Grains of Paradise can be used for blessing and removal of curses and hexes and to protect your home. Also called alligator pepper, guinea grains or guinea pepper, grains of paradise attract employment, increase gambling luck, protect the home, and increase business success. This spice is thought to be a mood enhancer and to promote good health when used in cooking. Grains of Paradise have a long history in folk magic. They're used for everything from business and money success, the building of magical charms to house spirits, and even in legal matters. A lodestone is a natural magnet. It's a piece of the mineral magnesite, and it's been magnetized. In many traditions of hoodoo and folk magic, a lodestone is used to attract money. Feeding the lodestone with bits of iron shavings will draw prosperity to you. You can also simply place this stone on top of your oil bottle if you don't want to put a stone inside of the liquid. Many witches place a small lodestone in a pouch and carry it with them to attract wealth, abundance, and financial success. A single pointed lodestone facing the door or a road facing window will draw prosperity and this stone will work with you to attract all that you most desire, including people, things, situations, opportunities, and the like. Magically, lodestone is used for its power of attraction and can be placed on an altar or worn during a ritual to increase a spell's power. It's been used for thousands of years to make amulets and talismans. Lodestone is excellent for grounding and protection from evil and spells. Ritual oils can be used to anoint candles, sigils, petition paper, crystals, mojo bags, poppets, and other ritual objects. Depending on the nature of the spell work and the ingredients of the oil, they can also be used to anoint the body and or personal belongings. However, many of the ingredients in this particular oil, such as grains of paradise and iron filings, may not be appropriate to apply to your skin. Never eat or drink a spell oil. If you decide to make black cat oil, I hope that this video has given you some ideas for ingredients and that you manifest the good luck that you desire. And if you enjoy this kind of art witch content, kindly leave a like on this video. Please enjoy the rest of the speed paint without further commentary.